Hey guys, what's up, Adumi Gang? I hope you're all having an amazing day because I'm having an amazing day. So if I'm having an amazing day, you guys should be having more than an amazing day. I'm right here, I'm right here, I'm right here. Right now, I just picked up Jamal, Rima from school, and whenever they come and they're in the house, this is what always happens. I can't even edit in my room. I can't even do anything in my room without these people in my door. Look, front of my door. Watch this. Watch this. Look, two, three. What are you guys doing? Why are you guys waiting in front of my door like like it's some kind? Let me see teeth. How does it look now? Say cheese. Damn, you're super gap boy. What? You're super gap boy. What? Yes, you are. Rima, let me see you. You gonna break out soon? Jamal, what about you? What? Every time he looks at the camera, he smiles. Look, watch this. Say cheese. Watch this. I'll take it off. Watch this. Watch this. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> He's such a poser. He's such a poser. What is good? I just met up with the homie Slim. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It takes us a while to meet up with each other, especially when his phone is about to die. Yeah. So this is what happened. Let me tell you guys. His phone completely died. Uh -huh. We're supposed to meet up uh, in 66th Street and Columbus Avenue. Uh -huh. And then his phone died. So when I went there, I'm looking all around for him. I can't text him. I can't call him. There's no way for me to like get in contact with him. But he's on 66th Street and Broadway. He's it's not. It's literally half the, half the block. It's, it's like a block away, but it's, you're not on. You're not on the right it's street. It's the same shit, bro. You're not on the right street, so I can't find him. You need to be well, on the right street. You gotta look. I had to ask someone to heal for their phone. No one trusts me because they don't want to rob him. You know why? Because <laughs> I'm not white. That's why I'm not white. <laughs> they don't trust me. So, the guy. Why you gotta say that? Why you gotta say that for the? I'm a scrawny ass, like tall Arab guy. They think I'm a rob. Come on, son. <laughs> shit. That was it. Rob me, son. <laughs> Did you got uh, did you guys see Slim's latest pictures? Like he wants to show his tattoos oh and pictures. He's like <laughs> He's like this, huh? <laughs> Let me start vlogging like this when I yo, what's up guys? How y'all doing? Yo, I didn't shut up. I'm bro. chilling, but <laughs> yeah, another picture, he's like, the ocean is that way. <laughs> <laughs> the beach is <laughs> No, I had some, I'm not gonna lie, I had some yeah, so I, everyone's glad that he took to those shoot. No, like a but like, but Adam was I had some, LA shirtless. Even though it was no, mad cold, exactly, no, it was not cold. It was not <laughs> no, no, I had some myself show my chest, but like that, that's not my chest. So like, it's already there, and I'm in the pool, I'm in the water, so it already shows it. Or I'm on the beach, so it already shows it. But some one was, was funnier because it's in his hand, and he's trying to show it. So, so he's like, if it doesn't fit in the Instagram picture, and he brings it up like, <laughs> what's going on? This is what you call cheerleading. That's sick. Sim, let's do that. Yo, let's do that. Yeah, yeah, I like carrying that. <laughs> Just met up with the homie Nakeep. Say what up. Yo, what's what's up? good? We're telling him about crazy LA stories. Yeah, man. So we had some had a crazy, amazing time. It was warm. Next time you gotta definitely come with us, yeah. bro. Look at this huge crayon. Oh, bro, this is my childhood, man. Right. What's up? Inside is Legos. This is Legos. You never I haven't seen this shit in my life in a long Lego. time. The big ones. Yeah, yeah big giant ones. Legos. What do you mean, what's your name? No, 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 no. Why? I want to write your name and my name together so we can get married. <laughs> and we'll be an amazing couple. No. Say hello. Hello. Say how are you? Hello. Say how are you? Why are you guys? Why are you guys in my Why are you in my luggage, huh? What are you doing in my luggage? Mawson. What's up with you, Gap Boy? Let me see your teeth now. I was gonna get an update on your teeth. Let me get an update on your teeth. Stand right here. Don't move. Let me get an update on your teeth. Right there, right? Right. Let me get an update on your teeth. Say cheese. Dee. Yes. <laughs> Say cheese. Say cheese. Gap boy. Hey. Hey. What's up, guys? It is now the next day. So how are you guys? Doing so, I'm gonna tell you guys the story on what happened, and why didn't I upload a vlog, and why I uploaded the skit instead. This is what you guys do not see. This is like behind the scenes what I'm gonna tell you guys right now. So I did. I decided not to upload the vlog because I thought it was. I, I don't know. I felt like it was not interesting enough. I felt like if I uploaded that vlog, you guys would be like, "Oh, it's just gonna be." A shitty vlog you probably were just lazy and wanted to upload anything so i felt like the vlogs before that i had it they were like so good so i needed something you know also good with it. i didn't want to like 
you have something good than something shitty after that. So I was like, you know what? I was literally about to sleep. It was midnight. Then 12.30 a.m. I got up. I got done editing the whole vlog. I'm like, you know what? I'm going to do a skit instead. So let me get up and do a skit. I got up. I had to think. I had four hours until my mom and dad wake up for fetch, which is around 4.30, 5.30. So they were sleeping, and I had to do everything in the living room and my room. So I woke up, and I started thinking. I'm like, hmm, what should I do? All right, tomorrow's Thanksgiving. Maybe I should do something similar, or like gathering. And I'm like, all right, I'm Arab. It's Thanksgiving. I should do something with Arab gatherings. Then I thought of ideas. I'm like, okay. The last time I had an Arab gathering was like a couple weeks ago, and it went crazy. Let me write down some stuff of crazy, interesting stuff that goes on, and I can put it into a skit. So I wrote it down quick in my notes. I literally pulled out my camera. I pulled out all the character clothes that I had and everything. I, I went to the living room, and I started record recording everything and filming everything. And it took me, it took me about two hours to film everything. It was so awkward because my parents were sleeping, and I had to like play woman characters and stuff like that. Luckily, they did not wake up. I, I, I snuck in my dad's room and I locked his door. Usually he sleeps with his door open. So I went in his room while he's sleeping and I closed the door so he can't hear my voice or anything. So I got everything done. I started editing it. It took me about maybe an hour, hour and a half to edit. So in three and a half hours, I got everything done. But I, I made a big, huge mess in my living room. Like I had all the characters clothes on the floor. Like I was just throwing it. I wanted to get everything done for you guys. So I got it done. And I, I seen some of you guys on Twitter telling me, Adam, it's okay if you have a lazy vlog sometimes, you know, we still enjoy your lazy talking, your this and that. But no, I, I want to, I want to continue to hustle. I want to, I want to keep this hustle going and showing you guys that like, that, that, uh, that I don't want to give you something shitty. I want to give you guys something, you know, something worth watching. That's why I decided to do the skit. And after that, it took an hour to upload. So about, it took me about four and a half hours to get it. And Alhamdulillah, I got it all done. And it was all cool. And all of you guys enjoyed it. So it was seriously like a game. It was like a competition. Like, Adam, you have three hours to come up with a skit idea. Do it. Edit it. Upload it. Now. Boom. I, I seriously think I I'm good with those. If you can tell me to like, all right, Adam, you have five hours to do this, do that. I can do it for a video. Like, I don't know. I find it like really fun to do also. Like, I like having that pressure on me sometimes. Sometimes. So I got it done. And then I did it. Upload it. And a lot of you guys enjoyed it. So alhamdulillah, you guys did enjoy it. I'm so happy you guys loved it. I, I will be doing a lot more skits but yeah i finally got the skit done and i decided to put the vlog up for today's vlog even though i did not do nothing today i did not do nothing at all today nothing i didn't do nothing i stayed home all day i was reading all your tweets i was tweeting a lot i was replying to a lot of you i was snapchatting a lot of you and also i was on twitter i was damning a lot of you and i was finding out who can play the girlfriend for my dad so i mean for, like on the prank on my dad so i found someone they wanted to keep themselves anonymous, but I found someone good who speaks Arabic, who's from New York, to make it more realistic. So I was so close to getting a Europe European person because my dad would fall for that because I'm always in Europe and stuff like that. So I got I decided to get a New Yorker, an Arab New Yorker, and I got the prank done on my dad. I had to wake him up. He was sleeping. He was taking a nap. I woke him up. I did the prank. It was probably the craziest shit ever. Guys, I'm not even hyping up, hyping up enough like that, but this is the first official prank that I've done on my dad, and it went so crazy. It's so... I couldn't hold my laugh. I was laughing seriously throughout the whole prank. I might show you guys a little, maybe a little preview at the end of this vlog if you guys continue to watch it, even if, it, even if you guys are like... Yeah, even if you guys are just watching me talk, so hopefully I give you guys something cool that's worth watching. I'm gonna give you guys a little sneak preview at the end of this vlog. So hopefully you guys do enjoy it. Other than that, um, also we have a New York City meet and greet. This is confirmed, the New York City meet and greet. This Saturday at Times Square, Times Square, 42nd Street, this Saturday at 2 p.m., 2 p.m. So to all my New York uh, New York City Doomy gang, everyone out there around the New York City era, make sure you guys come through, turn up. It's gonna be an amazing, amazing time. So I really hope you guys have fun and I cannot wait to meet you all. It's confirmed that also, Jamal will be there. He started crying. He's like, hey, he wants to be there. Why is Hamza Hayla, Mohsen, Rima going to be there, not Jamal? So Jamal, he, he spoke for his right. He was like, no, Adam, I'm protesting. If so you're going to bring everybody, how can you forget me? And I'm sorry, Jamal, for forgetting about you. But of course, you know, you're welcome. Although you're part of the Adams family. You're more than welcome. So all of us are going to be the, literally the whole Adams family other than Dina because Dina is like, Dina's just Dina. She's just like grumpy with everyone, but everyone else is just cool. You guys are gonna get to meet Mohsen, which is crazy. Like I'm so surprised. This is Mohsen is gonna be at the meeting, which is pretty crazy. Slim is gonna be there. Um, Rima's gonna be there. I'm gonna be there. Hamza, Hayla, and Jamal. I cannot wait 
to meet every single one of you guys in New York City. This I, I've never done like a meet and greet in public in New York City. Probably a couple years back, like in 2012, 2013. But this is one of my first ones in a really long time. So I really hope you guys can make it and come through, come through, come through. Because we got a meet and greet to do, baby. Come through, come through. Other than that, I'm going to be wrapping up this vlog. I'm so sorry I did not vlog nothing at all today. Because I had to film this prank, which will be up Sunday, in which I will be giving you guys a little preview. Oh, yeah, I don't know how long of a preview I should give you guys, but I want to give you guys just a little... Someone texted me. Just a little sneaky little preview like that for you guys to enjoy. Other than that, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Do me yank with another, with another regular, like, a, a good, interesting vlog. I promise you guys. Thank you guys so, so much for all your love and support. Seriously, you guys. Thank you so much for always giving like the vlogs a thumbs up. Even when I'm talking like that, you guys still give it a thumbs up and go turkeys. I do appreciate that. And seeing you guys, like right now I'm talking. I'm talking in this vlog. And seeing you guys still giving it a thumbs up, it shows me a lot. Shouldn't that you guys still do enjoy like hearing me talk and still watching my vlogs even if I do talk. But I promise you guys a crazy cool vlog tomorrow and a crazy, crazy prank on Sunday. I do not know what time yet, but a crazy prank on Sunday on my dad. It's finally done. It's done. It's crazy, but the prank on my dad is done. It's going to be super crazy, so I cannot wait for it. New York City meet and greet tomorrow, Saturday. I'll see you guys. This is Dumi Gang. Take care, and peace. I love you. Here's a sneak preview. Oh, what's up? What's up? Huh? Yeah, Huh? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Why? Yeah. Why? 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 Okay, um, you sure? Okay. I have, I have a girlfriend. I can tell him Hamel, Hamel pregnant, like him. Hamel? Hey, Hamel pregnant. Who's the father? Me, I'm the father. You're sucking the head of what? I didn't know. Why are you doing it?